गुड मॉर्निंग टू एवरी वन माई सेल्फ प्रोफेसर जगदीश प्रसाद शर्मा एम जी एन सी टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द डिस्पोजल ऑफ एक्सक्रीटा एक्सक्रीटा इन द सेंस बेस्ट प्रोडक्ट हाउ वी आर डिस्पोज सो इन दिस वाट इज द इफ वी आर डिस्पोज ऑफ द एक्सक्रीटा वाट इज द हेल्थ हजार ऑफ द इम प्रॉपर एक्सर डिस्पोजल If we are dispose of the excreta, it may be soil pollution, water pollution, contamination of food, and propagation of flies. If we are dispose of the excreta in proper way, it leads to the soil pollution, water pollution, contamination of food, and propagation of flies. And we are going to discuss how the spread of the disease from excreta. If the excreta defecated in the person in the open field then it's the contact with the flies fingers soils and and fish that it should lead to the contaminated food then contaminated food if they are consumed by the human body that it is the carrier of the uh, disease from the excreta to the human body then it what is the barrier how it is stop of that barrier of those uh, excreta if the feces previous slide we have to see the how the spread of the uh, contamination of the disease through the excreta there is there like a feces the feces if the barrier means if we have to re remove we should not contact such a things like the water finger flies soil and food the feces should not be contact with the those things like water finger flies soils and food then the it should be protected from the human body after that what is the method of the excreta disposal how we are prevent of the excreta from excreta from the contamination that is the method that is the unseaward area and the seaward area the unseaward area it is comes under subdivide service type lettering that also conservative conservation system second one is the non service type that is called sanitary lettering and third one is the lettering suitable for camps and temporary use then first we have to uh, describe about the non service type or sanitary lettering sanitary lettering it is pore hole lettering duck bell lettering water seal lettering water seal lettering also two types pra type rc types sulab sochale and fourth one is the septic tank and fifth is aqua previ the and the, uh, in this lettering suitable for camps and temporary use that is shallow trench lettering deep trench lettering pit lettering borehole lettering so four lettering suitable for camps it is the four types and the service area lettering it is the primary treatment secondary treatment and other method conservation system cartage uh, conservation system that is service type lettering in the service type lettering also uh, example for bu bucket lettering in what bucket lettering that is disadvantage of the smell flies producing and health risk of the pupil handling the excreta and other disadvantage is the health risk from food crops and fertilize with the raw excreta that is the disadvantage of the bucket lettering that is comes under the service type lettering and the non service type lettering that is also called the sanitary lettering so in this sanitary lettering what is the criteria for a sanitary lettering excreta should not be contaminated the ground and the surface water excreta should not pollute the soil excreta should not be accessible to flies rodent and animals 
Excretors will not create a noisance due to odor or unsightly appearance. So that is the criteria of the sanitary latrine. In the sanitary latrine, first one is the borehole latrine. The borehole latrine, it is the first introduced by the Rock Filler Foundation during 1930 in campaign of hookborne control. The latrine consists of a circular hole that is the 30 to 40 centimeter in diameter dug vertically into the ground to a depth of 4 to 8 meters, most commonly 6 meters. And the, a concrete squatting plate with a central opening and footrest is placed over the hole. In the overall lettering also suitable enclosure is put up to the provide privacy. In the in this uh, pictures, how we are construct the boro lighting that we have to dug the well that is the depth of the 4 to 8, uh, 8 meter depth and 30 to 40 centimeter in diameter and upper part it is a squitting plate. And what is the merit and advantage of the boro lighting? No need for the service of a sweeper for daily removal of night soils. That is we see the uh, service type lighting that is the bucket type lighting. So in this borrow lighting, no need for the sweeper for daily removal of the night soils. That is the very foremost example of the uh, uh, borrow lighting. And second advantage is the unsuitable for fly breeding because of the open field def defecation is prohibited this is should not contaminated by the flies and soil pollution also control so borolating second advantage is the unsuitable for fly breeding third advantage it if located 50 meter away from the source of water supply there should be no dangers of water pollutions the boro lettering should be considered away from the source of water supply so water supply should not be contaminated by the excreta and feces and what is the demerit of the boro lettering a small capacity because of the depth of the uh, boro lettering is the small so collection of the feces it is the small capacity Second demerit is the a special a agar is required for the construction by, uh, which may not be ready available. While we are dugging of the borehole lighting, it will require of the instruments should be required. So that is second it is a disadvantage and demerit of the borehole lighting. Next is the demerit in many places the subsoil water is high and soil loose with the result it may difficult to dig dig a hole deeper than 3 meter. In many areas the water level is the upper water level so we should not dug the boro lighting because water resource is available so we should not dug the proper boro lighting. So this is the disadvantage of the boro lighting. Next one is the dug bell lighting. Dug bell lighting it is a circular pit about 75 centimeter in diameter and 3 to 3.5 meter deep. The pit may be lined with pottery links to prevent caving in of the soil. Pottery ring it is the concrete cement ring it is available in market. A concrete squatting plate is placed on the top of the pit and lettering is enclosed with a super structure. Thank you.